Oh my God, that's actually hilarious. <laughs> I can't believe that just happened. Dude, that's insane. <laughs> that's why I created this Claude project for you, this Claude prompt on how to prompt emotion out of 11 Labs V3. 11 Labs V3 just dropped and yesterday, just yesterday, somebody asked me, what do you think is needed in order for voice AI agents to be widely adopted? And I said two things. Number one, fixing transcription. This does not fix transcription. But the second thing was getting expression into the voice, being able to guide expression into the voice. And now we have, yeah, I mean, everybody calls their, their own agents like the most expressive text-to-speech model, sure. But now we can prompt emotion into the agent. Let me show you what I mean. So one of our clients really wanted us to do this one thing when calling businesses. And it was mirroring the greeting back to the receptionist. So if the receptionist goes, Edmondson Storage Solutions, this is Jennifer, the agent should go, and this is kind of what he trains his people on, is, hello, Edmondson Storage Solutions, this is Jennifer, how are you? So now we can use these tags uh, in order to uh, essentially, well, we got hard code emotion. This is kind of what it sounds like. Edmonton Storage Solutions, this is Jennifer. Hello, Edmonton Storage Solutions, this is Jennifer. How are you? Oh my God. That's so over the top. <laughs> Everybody gets a, gets a kick out of it. Um, but when our V2 does it, it does not sound good at all. Actually, let me show you side by side what that difference is. Hello, Edmonton Storage Solutions. This is Jennifer. How are you? But the cadence and the tone and, and the actual smile, physical smiling has an effect from human to human that no voice can replicate. But they're getting really close now. We, in fact, we removed it from the scope of the project doing that because V2, V2.5 just were not getting it because you don't have control. But we finally have voice prompting. And that is, this is like, this is, this is a game changer. People talk about game changers. This is kind of one of the two final pieces of the whole voice AI game. The LLM is now solved. I think that once we got GPT 4.1, you know, we can now do, uh, get the AI, even with a single prompt to do what we needed to do. Voice, it's, it's been getting better, but again, we don't have that tone control. And uh, transcription is the other is the other issue. Um, and and now I would call a uh, uh, voice generation now solved. You see how they they give you two generations here. Okay, well, technically voice generation is not Edmonton solved. Edmonton Storage Solutions. This is Jennifer. Hello, Edmonton Storage Solutions. This is Jennifer. How are ya? Like, sure, that that could work, but it doesn't quite do what I want it to do. So, so it all needs some iterations uh, for generation two. Edmonton Storage Solutions. This is Jennifer. Hello, Edmonton Storage Solutions. This is Jennifer. How are ya? <laughs> and it's like way too fast, but it's it's getting closer to what I'm asking it to do, other than pausing. I. I that's supposed to be the one thing that it was all already able to do. Um, so so we're getting closer to voice prompting. So let's see the difference one more time. I'm going to regenerate speech. See what it comes up with. Edmonton Storage Solutions, this is Jennifer. Edmonton Storage Solutions, this is Jennifer. Hello, Edmonton Storage Solutions, this is Jennifer. How are you? Yeah, yeah that's, exact, that's exactly it. Maybe a little bit slower, but I did ask it to go quickly. Man, this this is this makes all the difference. But it's not really gonna make a difference if you grab a prompt and if you grab one of your prompts and you don't like teach it to do it. And that's why I created this Claude project for you, this Claude prompt that you can plug in anywhere, and it'll it essentially contains all the prompting guides on how to prompt emotion out of Eleven Labs V three. So it'll have like different types of emotions and then pacing controllers. And very importantly, how do we do use these emotions, the before and after, like emotional escalation, conversation naturalness, tags like friendly, curious. I tell my, my prompts to, to, you know, act curiously uh, uh, and inquiringly. 
but it doesn't translate to the voice generation. And now it does. This is super, super powerful. And I think it fundamentally changes how we're going to be uh, uh, creating these prompts, especially the instructions around how, what does the LLM output? And now the LLM has to also output these tags. So 11 Labs V3 can read those tags so it can generate incredibly natural voice agents. So, Edmonton Storage Solutions. So I, I want you to see like V3 without any tags is the first one. Edmonton Storage Solutions, this is Jennifer. Hello, Edmonton Storage Solutions, this is Jennifer. How are you? And and with tags, it completely changes the vibe. So, so very, very cool. I created a whole prompting guide for you it's going to be linked below into the community and you can learn everything that you need to learn in order to make these voice agents way more expressive and doing it the right way because with 11 labs v3 it's not only about using the tags it's uh, about choosing the right voice as well so everything you need to know is here and if you want to create a gpt or a cloud project that creates these prompts for you i created a prompt for you to be able to give those instructions. And now ChatGPT Claude is going to be able to create from what you have now to these tags, emotional uh, and expressive voice agents. So check it out. It's all linked below. I'll see you in the community. Oh, wait, what? <laughs> oh my God, that's actually hilarious. <laughs> <laughs> I can't believe that just happened. Dude, that's insane. Oh, that's so cool. Wait, what? <laughs> oh my God, that's actually hilarious. <laughs> I can't believe that just happened. Dude, it's so good. Oh my God, it's so good. Oh God, that's so freaking good. And this is just one emotion that a level SV3 can create. I'm going to go way, way, way deeper. Stay tuned for the next videos.